Hey everybody, it's me, Pacific. Okay, Americans, I know you guys are going to get mad at me for this one. But like I told you, I'm doing music reviews, and I'm going to go all over the place with this. This one is Daya Daya, which is India, they're Bollywood. And I want to say some upbeat things about this stuff. Okay, you're all going to go, come on, Pacific, India? Some Americans, the minute they hear foreign music, they just stop up their ears and make comments and make fun and put down. But I'm going to tell you something. First time I pulled up this video, I was pulled into it immediately. I was like, oh, that makes me want to get up and just, oh, yeah. This stuff is good stuff. You remember <clears throat> back in the 50s when America used to do a lot of choreography and in, in acting and in movies and even in music and that has just pretty much disappeared I think Sister Act was one of the last movies to actually do choreography and all the people dancing and having fun day a day is outstanding let's start with the choreography I love it men and women the costume the women in there are beautiful I want to say something like Christian brothers and sisters out there some of you would go ah oh, Pacific what are you watching this stuff for I'll tell you why I'm watching it. In the U.S., we have a Christian culture that sometimes gets it right, and most of the time does not. Christian culture in the U.S. tends to put down anybody around the world that's different than them and label them as heathen and pagan. I don't agree with that. <clears throat> culture is unique to each ethnicity, each geographical location, and some things are good about culture, and some things are not. Therefore, the women that are dancing in there that are showing midriffs and shoulders and stuff, I think they're beautiful. And I think that their dance is very cultural. Love the long black hair. Love all the bracelets and the net jewelry that these India women wear. And it showcases India women at their best, in my opinion. The choreography is beautiful. The costume and the colors and the dancing and the upbeatness. I listen to this and I watch it and I go, you know what? They're just flat out having fun. And I like it because it is representative of so much of Bollywood music right now. And I listen to it and it doesn't take me down the toilet. And I'm going to say this again. There's so much American music that is depressing. Even if they intend it to be upbeat, it has a minor key to it. And you just come away feeling aki. Deya Deya. If you cannot feel moved to get out of your seat and dance, well, then you're too American. And I'm appealing to my international viewers. Many of you are exposed to good music. I was thinking, I would love so much to have a radio station, and I'm not talking satellite radio. I would like to have a radio station where I do my commentary, but where we play all kinds of music and not the same 13 songs in a row every hour. I would like a radio station with not one commercial at all. Pacific Radio, Radio Pacific. I'm telling you, man, it would be hot. But I'd like it to have a transmitter that could go all across this nation and, yes, even overseas. But <laughs> you need big money for that. I think Americans sell themselves short. They don't get good exposure. I play the radio station on the bus for my students and I notice something. They're just not getting exposure. They think that the top 10 in the U.S. is where it's at. And I listen to this stuff day in and day out and go, you know what? This stuff really, all in all, at the end of the day, is pretty crappy. It's, it isn't talent. It all has a sameness to it. It's all singing about sex, drugs, getting high. What is it? Bruno Mars, your sex takes me to paradise. Ah, disgusting. But Dea Dea, it weighs in to me at 100%. Good music, good female vocalists in there. The dancing, the choreography, the costume, the women. It's beautiful, it's well done, it's moving, it's lively, and it's all upbeat. So, and keeping these under five minutes, click on it, check it out, and stretch your senses a little bit. And start trying to get into international music, folks, because we're not promoting it in the U.S., and it's time we do so. I give Dea Dea a huge thumbs up. This is Pacific, signing off. Bye-bye.